All right, here is my favorite foliage plant. This is called Canna Tropicana. And if you want to bring the look of the tropics to your patio, this is the plant to go for. Now, Canna Tropicana is an Anthony Tesler plant. That's the guy who developed these great colorful cannas. You can buy them this great big size at uh, the nurseries. You can also find them in a smaller size container. Um, I like to use the bigger ones for great big containers. And let me show you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make a container garden with a tropical look with a twist. First of all, notice this pot here. It is broken. Yep, I reuse broken pots, especially when you're doing something wild and jungle-like. And I'm gonna put this great big can of towards the back. Now, here's a great tip. When you design a container garden, this one is just set into a flower bed. You only see it from the front. So I'm putting the height at the back rather than put the tall plant in the middle. Now, what contrasts with these big paddle-shaped leaves is I'm picking up the fact that there is a hot pink vein in the middle of these burgundy canna tropicana leaves. And so I found a cherry colored cordyline. A cordyline has great spiky foliage, direct contrast with the broad paddle shaped leaves of the canna tropicana. So I'll put that nestled in right beside canna tropicana. And now because I've picked up on the cherry, I want a great foliage contrast. So here is a hookara. Cucaras are perennial plants. They come back year after year. Lime green foliage, again, a different shaped leaf. So a different texture, but because we have these spiky pink flowers, a great match with the hot pink cherry sensation cordyline and the canna tropicana. So that's gonna go in front. And you see I got a little bit of a creeping jenny trailing out the sides of that broken pot. Now, great foliage plants for any container garden are the sweet potato vine. This is a lime green margarita sweet potato vine. This one is sweet caroline red. Both of these are foliage plants that really add to the very tropical Hawaiian look of any container garden. So I can also add those once again putting the contrasting foliage, the purple next to the lime green, maybe a little bit of lime green over here right by your can.